Good evening, I'm Micah Ullman. Punched, kicked, and threatened with an axe. A campus safety officer at Fullerton College is confronted by a group of teens. It happened in the campus quad before the start of classes this morning. KTLA Shelby Nelson has more on the brutal attack and reaction from students. Not only was this a brutal, unprovoked attack, but these were three young suspects, allegedly three teenagers who carried out something so violent and for no apparent reason. I've always seen this as a pretty quiet campus around here. Quiet now, but it was just hours ago when a campus safety officer found himself the target of a violent, unprovoked attack at Fullerton College. Just after 6 a.m., school officials say he noticed three people sitting on a bench near this building next to the quad area, one of them appearing to be in medical distress. It seemed like he couldn't stand up properly, and so the officer thought he might be in distress. Just when the officer checks in on him, authorities say the three teens start attacking him, punching, kicking, and even gouging his eyes. The officer calling for backup. Once other officers arrive, that's when authorities say one of the suspects then pulls this tomahawk-style axe from his backpack, swinging at them. 18-year-old Elijah Balfa Fullerton was detained by officers. The other two ran, but were later captured. A 17-year-old who allegedly had the axe and 18-year-old Austin Valdovinos, both from Fullerton. Neither of them are students at the college. It did kind of scare me a little bit because I was like, oh, well, I wonder what really, like, kind of went down, you know. Gloria Ruvakova is among the students who received this email from the college president. The details on the attack were vague, nowhere in the notes stating anything about the acts. You just never know what you could expect. It's crazy, like the world that we live in. Students say there are always campus safety officers around. But in the end, if they're the ones that are getting attacked, then that makes you wonder, like, for your own safety. As for the 53-year-old officer, he was hospitalized with minor injuries and is now recovering at home. The incident itself spurring concerns over safety and school officials ask that students always remain vigilant. We want people to be aware of their surroundings, to be careful. We do have campus safety here to protect people, so we have campus safety escorts in case people feel uncomfortable for any reason. And school officials say they do have 57 blue light emergency phones on campus. In the meantime, police are investigating. They say this does not appear to be driven by any political, racial or ideological motives. Those suspects have been arrested and will be charged with assault with a deadly weapon. That's the very latest from Fullerton. I'm Shelby Nelson, KTLA 5 News.